So guys, since I'm doing a Nintendo Switch video, I had to find a way to, you know, record Nintendo Switch footage. Which, you can imagine, it's not the easiest thing in the world, because the only way you can record natively on the Nintendo Switch is by um, recording 60 second clips, and then you would have to um, do your mic separately, and then, and then, and then just keep recording 60 second clips, and somehow find a way to bring it onto your computer. There has to be some other way other than just keep recording 60 second clips, right? Well then I found out about something. Hi, I'm Jeffrey Mulgado Gaming, and today I'm going to show you how to set up your Elgato Capture Card with a Nintendo Switch. The Elgato Game Capture Card, HD 60S. I have a way to make this video. And then I had to find a way to make it work with the computer, because I only had one HDMI port, and that went to the monitor, and I needed another one for the capture card to work. Hence why this video took so long, because I was supposed to make this July 2020. And also I'll have a sprite with me, since I'm doing something right after this. Oh, it's invisible, because it's green. So since I use RPG Maker um, into game making, I thought, let's make a video on the Nintendo Switch RPG Maker MV and see how it is. That's what this video is. After all that Elgato stuff. Alright, so let's just fade. Um, let's go, let's go. I'm typing with a keyboard. It's a gamer. Andy's game. Alright, so let's start off making our characters. How are you today? I'm here too, Mom. Oh, Kagzilla. Taiko is here too. How about you take Taiko to that festival he's been talking about? I was actually planning on meeting up with a friend of mine. 
I'm like, you have your phone back if you take him. How about that? Alright, Taika, when is that festival? This looks fine. Yep, and then if we talk to the mom... Now that we've made all of that, let's talk about my thoughts. My thoughts on RPG Maker MP from the Nintendo Switch. Do it on the computer version. I mean, you can do everything you can on here. More easier and just use custom stuff. It's just overall better on the computer version. Unless you can't get a computer version or something like that. I could see value in getting into the Switch version when you're like young. When people like use RPG Maker to make really good games, they use custom stuff and all that, which in everything they use, which they can't do on this. You can't have plugins or custom assets or hey it's just even hard to do the stuff they let you do like just that little thing i just did there that has I, i've been working on this for an hour and 13 minutes and i was just able to do that like i'm already tired out exhausted which is not something you want to be after only working for like an hour and 13 minutes on it. It's really not what you want to happen. You want to be able to just work on hours and end and make progress on it. You don't want to be tired and done with it after only an hour and 13 minutes and not getting really anything done. Just get it on PC for you to get it. I mean, it's cheaper on Switch. Only buy like 20 bucks. No, don't even get MV on PC, get MZ on PC. Because it has the name Windows, which the Switch has. The Switch version has more music and more assets for you to use, but you, aren't, you don't want to use the pre made assets they give you. You want to use your own assets, which they can't, they don't let you do. So, it's really like Mario Maker this point. It's not a game making software, it's Mario Maker. If you can, just get RPG Maker MZ on the PC. That's just what is gonna be helpful the most. But with that, that ends my review and video on RPG Maker MV for the Switch. I wouldn't recommend this unless you really need to get it for the Switch. And if you're getting the console version, get it for the Switch. Do not get it for the PS4. Do not get it for Xbox. Get it for the Switch. Unless you don't have a Switch. Well, then just get it for PC. That ends my thoughts and my conclusion. I wish it was more positive, but I, I really do wish it was more positive. But hey, here we are. But yeah, hopefully more console content in the future since I can now. Oh boy, you don't realize how long it took us a year to get the capture card working. But we got capture card now. I can do stuff with consoles, which means more content. Yeah, that ends this video. See you next one. Bye.